Hello and welcome to this My Theme Shop video tutorial. Over the next couple of minutes I'm going to be showing you how to use the inbuilt translation panel in your My Theme Shop theme in order to translate your WordPress theme straight from the admin panel. Now currently um, not all themes have this feature and if your theme doesn't then there's another video in our collection which will show you an alternative method to translate your theme. If your theme does though then um, you want to head straight to appearance and then click theme options. And from the theme options panel, you want to head all the way down to translate and click that to load up the theme translation panel. Now this isn't enabled by default in order to load the options panel faster. So to turn on translations, you just need to tick the enable translation panel box and you'll see this loads your translation options here. Now this is very simple to use. All you need to do is search for the words you want to translate in English. So perhaps comments and then the options panel will load all of the um, all the bits of text in the theme which use that word or phrase and now all you need to do to translate them is um, find the appropriate word or phrase you want to translate and just enter in the translation in a different language once you're done then um, just click save changes at the bottom here and you'll see the changes immediately reflected on your site so for example if I wanted to translate say uh, no comments yet into French. I would just uh, type the French in here, which is pas encore de commentaire, and then hit save changes. Now that's going to immediately make those changes on the site. And if I load up my site here, then I can see up top here, instead of saying no comments, it says uh, pas de encore de commentaire, which is the French that I've just added in. So if I now wanted to add in more translations, then I just need to go back to the theme translation panel and then add those in and just click save. Now the theme translation panel isn't just limited to translations though. You can also use it to change any of the text on your website. For example, you might like to change the uh, text that says add a comment to your feedback please. Or um, say for this one, this post is password protected and the password to view comments. You might like to change that to please log in in order to view these comments and so on and so forth. So you can customize the text as well as translating it. You can customize it to have it how you would like it to display. If you decide that you'd like to reset back to how it was, you can click the reset translations button and then OK. And that will reset back to the theme's defaults without overwriting any of the other changes you've made. And of course, if you want to disable the theme translation panel, then you just untick that box and click save. That's all there is to it. If you run into any problems or have any questions, then head over to the My Theme Shop community. And thank you very much for watching.